Okay? And you brought food. Amen. If not, leave life early and go get some food and come join us. Uh, let's stand to our feet. Just get ready to worship the Lord today. Can we do that today? Can we just worship the Father? He's just worthy of our praise. Uh, when we get into His presence, really everything else is secondary. It should be secondary because He's first. Amen. Because He's first. Amen. He's worthy of our praise. The Lord is good. His love endures. His mercy endures forever. His faithfulness is to all generations. Psalms 100, verse 5. Something like that. Amen. So God, we just love you. We praise you. We worship you. We honor you today. Come on, let's just do that right now. Come on, everybody. Come on, worship your God this morning. Go ahead and just tune in. It's just you and him here. The worship team, they're here, but they're really not here. This is this is all about you and him, your creator, God. And God, we just love you. We just give you praise. We honor you in this house this morning. Others will be coming in, but let's just go ahead and start worshiping and praising the Lord this morning. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank 
as adults, you know, we should be leading the way in our worship. Amen. They're watching. But we should just push everything else aside this morning because he's here. Did you know he's here? You knew you were aware of that? The King of Kings and the Lord of Lords is in this house right now. So whatever you have need of, if you'll just push that to the side, say, God, I'm going to worship you in your house. I'm going to praise you anyway. There's a lot of the crowd in my place. But as you get into the heavens and worship him and acknowledge his presence, you got to acknowledge his presence. It's here. God will start working on your behalf, but it's all about him, not you. So I just want to encourage you this morning to enter into the worship and the praise. I'm already there. I was here before I got I was there before I got here this morning. I was there last night. I was out of my own business trying to watch the ball game, Pastor. And I walk in my house and all these crazy ladies are just praying, praying, giving God praise. I'm like, oh God, I can't go anywhere without being in this presence. That's the word. It's about 30 or 40 minutes just going crazy and praising God and worshiping God for this church in my house last night. I'm like, all right, I'm out of here. Like, tell me y'all stay. But we need to do our thing this morning. He's worthy. Amen. You've got to acknowledge him. I'm just telling you. You just, I don't know how you do it. I don't know what your background is. Maybe you might, I don't know, just sit there. That's fine. But just acknowledge him because he's worthy. Something happens properly when we start to praise and worship God. Amen. Amen. And, and I, want, I want to help you out this morning if you're having a rough time. I came off the drums just to let you know you wouldn't be here if it wasn't for God. You wouldn't, you wouldn't be here. I wouldn't be here. You, would, you wouldn't be here if it wasn't for God. He's worthy of our praise. Amen. You might be here, but you'd be a mess. Father, we just worship you. Can we just go over there? Let's all be in our hands this morning. Come on. You're not in a place to where you, you get away with this here. Come on and just lift your hands and honor him and worship him this morning. Come on, let's worship. Church, come on. Jesus, I'm the center of it all. Jesus, I am the center of it all. You came to the earth, you brought me all. Jesus, I am the center of it all.